Have you been asking yourself, what have I been doing wrong? Why is my hair not growing? Like, I've tried almost everything and it's not working out. Well, here are a few reasons why those products or those steps that you're taking are not working out. Hi, welcome to my channel. My name is Melody. Today we're going to be talking about something very important and I can relate to that. Have you been asking yourself, what have I been doing wrong? Why is my hair not growing? Like, I've tried almost everything and it's not working out. Well, here are a few reasons why those products or those steps that you're taking are not working out. Here are the few reasons why your hair is not growing. Now, the first reason is you're using the wrong product. Most of us, when we go to a, we go to a lot of like we go to social media and we see people with good hair we see their hair that is very nice we just we just go down to the, the comment section to type what type of hair cream are you using what type of this are you using we just go and pick the hair cream without even knowing what type of hair hair like what what hair type do these people have what hair type do you have you go and get a product that is meant for 4C hair for your for a hair. You get a product that is meant for for a hair for 4C hair. You're not going to see any any, any progress in that. It's just like you using a like you have headache and you you go to the hospital to get a, a medicine for stomach ache. It is going to be for stomach and not for your headache. That is it. So you have to know what exactly you're getting. There are different types of hair, not just the 4C, the 4B, the 4A, the 3, times the 2, and so on. We still have low priority hair and high priority hair. You can see someone that has 4C hair, but the person's hair is the person has a low priority hair, while someone else has a high priority hair hair type of and you want to go and use you that have low porosity type of hair you want to go and use products for someone that is that has high porosity hair you're not going to see any any um result out of it it's just going to be like you're stressing your hair so i think we're going to talk about these types of hair and the porosity and so on i know most of you might you might not understand what i'm talking about but with time we're going to talk about it maybe in another video we're going to talk about it and the kind of products you have to be using first of all you knowing how you know whether your hair is high has a proxy that is high or low proxy hair then the type of product that you're going to use to to for like for an improvement or a good result like a positive result for this type of hair now another reason why your hair is not growing is because you feel it's not growing. Yes. I've seen a lot of people speak so bad about their hair. They're like, ah, my hair is not growing. No, my hair is not growing. This hair that I have does not grow. It does. Who said so? Your hair grows. Yes, your hair grows. No matter how you feel it's not growing, it grows. If it doesn't grow, you would have had a bald head. Yes, <laughs> your hair would have been bald. But because it grows, that's why you can see strength of hair on your head. That's why even if you cut it, it will still grow up. So since your hair grows, know that it grows. So since it grows, look for ways to help it to grow. Just look for ways to help it to grow. I hope you are claiming that. Now the next reason why your hair is not growing, I think I'm going to mention like five five reasons the next reason your hair is not growing is this you are let me say you're using your using the wrong hair stylist or hair yes hair stylist i can relate to this i'm talking about i personally i've been into people like salons let's say salons yeah or hairdressers or hairstylists 
where I have been to them and they start complaining about my hair, your hair is this, your hair, they use that frustration of your hair type to comb up and um, comb off your hair. Like, if you keep going there, you see your hair will not be doing well. Your hair will not be doing well. If you're going to someone that doesn't know how to take care of natural hair, it just, see, your hair, they, they, since your hair is not straight, it's not relaxed, you have to, the same way you treat relaxed hair when you're making it, you know, when you're, 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 you're braiding a relaxed hair, it's, it's very, like, there's no strands on it. It's just straight off. But when you come to our kinky hair, our afro hair, you cannot drag out your hand easily. And when you're making, you have to take care in making that hair. So when you meet someone that does not know how to do this, the person will comb off your hair and even they will give you hairstyles that are so tight, very tight. Because of the complaint and the frustration, as I said before, they will whiff up your hair. And if you keep going there to keep making your hair, in fact, before you finish maybe two weeks of you carrying this towel, when you lose your hair, you must have had a lot of hair loss. Like, your hair must have fallen off finish. <laughs> so I've witnessed that. Like, I went to a salon to make my hair. She used, she was using actually rat hair comb to comb a hair that, I myself like it was so like she was combing it continuously. I said, "Madam, it's okay, please. It's okay. Thank you very much. Like it's okay. I can't take it anymore. Like my head, my scalp was hot. It was as if they wrote hot pepper on it. So I said, this is another reason why your hair is not growing. You just neck. It's just like you're neglecting your hair just because you want to get a fitting style. Okay and." You want to get a style like you saw this style hair style. Ah, I like this weaving. I like this weaving. Please, who did it for you? I'm not even thinking of your own type of hair. Who did this weaving for you now? You now go there and I want it to be exactly like this, okay? But remember, hi, this person's hair is straight. Your hair take this type of. You're not even looking how tight it is. They will now weave you that kind of tight hairstyle that. When you lose your hair, half of it will go off. Okay, I think I think that is another reason why your hair is not growing. Now I want you to sit back, as I'm telling you the reasons why your hair is not growing. Think of what you can do to help this hair of yours. If you cannot make your hair by yourself, just look for someone that, that can take care of the hair for you. Like not just any house that is ah, there's somebody that plates hair. Yeah, she plates fine fine hair. Can she make your hair, kinky hair? That's another thing. Can she make it before you go there and your front hair will go finish? So, that's another reason. So, another reason why your hair is not growing is you're using the wrong type of comb. Yes. There's, uh, there's something I want you to know. Like, there's no how you comb your hair that your hair will straight. I far it's not straight. Your hair is 4C, it's 4C, right? Or it's 4, 4 type 4. It's kind of straight, unless you straighten it. But if you think you can use comb, another comb to comb your hair, it's free. It was some time. It's, 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 what do you call it again? It's matte, yeah, they call it matte, it's matte. Like, it's, it's, even if you comb it, just shrink back. Comb, shrink back, comb, shrink back. So, if you're not saying let me use, I will comb this hair until it's straight. You're doing yourself when you're breaking your hair. Just break it off. Break it off. So that's another reason why your hair is not growing. I think I've mentioned like four. Yes, I think I've mentioned like four. Okay, why your hair is not growing again is over manipulation. Like, you're over manipulating your hair. You're not allowing your hair to breathe. You're not allowing it to rest. Today, I was selling the, this one. The other day, another one. This one, another one. The other one. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, what happened? I like to rest now. Like now, I 
I just styled my hair like this. Is this the, this is the second or the third day of this hair this style I just made because I just loosed it out from a twist out like a twist, and I didn't want to like stress my scalp. I have a very sensitive scalp. I, I think okay, that's another reason again. Let's let me continue what I'm saying. See, I loosed it. I just wanted this scalp to rest. Just rest. Let it rest. Allow it to rest. You're not struggling with any body. Allow your hair to rest. Can another reason why you feel your hair is not growing again is you feel you're competing with someone. You're not competing with anybody. It's your hair. That this person's hair is growing longer than yours doesn't mean that your own is not growing. You're not competing with anybody. Just take your time. Give your hair time. It will grow. As well as you're doing the right things that I just mentioned the mistakes that we're making and you find that you're not making this mistake, you're at the right part. It will grow. Yeah. It will grow. Another reason again why your hair is not growing is um I'll be ending this video here. So if you have not subscribed to my channel yet, please subscribe and turn up your notification bell because here it's a good place for you to be and I have great content for you to help you in your nutrition and your hair growth journey thank you for watching